What are we gonna do today? So today we are gonna be working on a 69 Camaro convertible. With a convertible, there are special considerations. So first of all, what we need to do before we remove the rocker panel, we need to weld in support pieces both vertically and horizontally. And because we're doing this, this will maintain the integrity of the overall vehicle. It's very important when you work on a convertible that you put support pieces in place so you have a frame of reference when you put the new rocker panel on the vehicle. Yeah. God, this Stay is in that in, in that gap. I made my bed, I'm gonna lay in it. Alright. A lot better. That's a lot better. I can I can hear it. Okay. We won't, there won't be any welding for a while. And now the worst part, cutting. We're about to remove the quarter and reveal 30 years of just stuff. History of the car. You ready? Okay. How's it look? There's some sand in there. Oh, and why is there sand in here? Holy crap! Ah! Because this car spent a lot of years at the beach. Wow, look at that. Florida car. That's awesome. Later? Yeah. All right. I guess I need gloves on. Turkeys now. Okay. Is there some more sand in there? Sheesh. I'm removing the remainder of the quarter panel. This piece of metal they do not make in reproduction, so we had to make sure that we were very careful when removing this remainder of the quarter panel from this piece right here. This is the quarter support. For a convertible. So we're using this level to establish a baseline for our old rocker panel. When the new one goes on, we want it to be pretty close to the same level. Now we have to separate the B panel from the rocker panel before we can remove it. And we want to be careful by not damaging that flange. So the rocker is connected here here and to the wheel well itself. On the front, it's connected to the A pillar on the outside as well as the inside. We're gonna have to drill out the spot welds on the A pillar. Okay, we're not replacing any part of the A pillar, so we have to preserve it. Mm -hmm. So we have a couple of reference points, locating pieces. This helps to locate the front of the rocker and this part right here helps locate the seat belt hold. And then there's another right here that is another reference point for when we put the new rocker on. Like this. Go for it.
probably out. To what? Oh, I th you you wouldn't answer me. You looked at me funny and then you started- I can't hear you. You started touching stuff. I'm trying to loosen that. <sighs> trying to undo it, honey. Oh. What are we still hung on? So see if you can figure out what it's hung on. What will I film? What is it? Look right through here. <gasps> that little thing? That little corner. Okay. Okay, watch your feet. All right. Off the camera. Nice job. Look at the sand. Oh! Oh my gosh! Look at that. Are you kidding me? Oh! <gasps> There's more. Oh my god! We can make a sand castle. I think we just lightened the Camaro by 40 pounds. Holy shit. Is it still coming? Oh my god. That is ridiculous. That's rust. That's rust. Well, it's a good thing we're changing these rocker panels. Wow. Holy crap. Oh shit, I forgot to start spinning. See if it pops. No. No, you didn't really get in there. Oh. Gotta get between those pieces. Here? Yep. And you got it. Really? Rust inside the rocker. horizontal support piece that we welded on the A pillar and the B pillar. Uh, so we have a frame of reference. We removed the quarter panel, as you can see here, since we're going to be ultimately replacing this one. And then the quarter support uh, door jam, which is this piece right here. They do not make this in reproduction, so we had to be very, very careful when removing this one. This is unique to a convertible. Uh, and as we mentioned earlier, there are a lot of things to take into consideration when working with a convertible because you don't have a top. And so you have to be very, very careful when you're removing structurally important pieces like the rocker panel that you have frames of reference in place, such as, as we did. Um, hey, ah, something got in my foot. Holy shit. Are you okay? Oh my God. It was like a... Did it hurt? Like a needle. No, it's a needle. It's... I can't believe it went all the way through your shoe. I want to see what it is. It's like a, a sewing needle. And we thought we were going to get by without having to replace this part down here, but it was pretty rough once we removed the rocker panel. Okay, so uh, this is really the end of part one. Um, all we've done is remove the rocker panel. Next phase is going to be the new rocker panel install. So be sure to stay tuned for that. That's gonna be an exciting part because once that's taken place, 
things are just gonna be added on. We're gonna be doing the quarter panel, the new one, floor pans, all kinds of exciting stuff. And don't forget to like and subscribe. We've got some exciting projects coming up. We have a number of projects and um, I think you'll really be interested in seeing the transformation of this car.